video I am going to give the solution for the important problem from random variables and distribution functions. For the discrete probability distribution, the x values are given as 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And here, the probability distribution function is 0, 2k, 2k, 3k, k square, 2k square, 7k square plus k. First of all, we have to find the value of k and next mean and the next one is variance. So, let's get started to find the value of k. So, as they are... Uh, 6x values that is probability of i is equal to 0 to 6 probability of uh, x is equal to xi is equal to 1 total probability is 1 therefore i am going to add all these that is 0 plus 2k plus 2k plus 3k plus k square plus 2k square plus 7k square plus k is equal to 1 so, if I add, this is 7k, 2k, that is 9, this value is 10k square. So, this is 10k square plus 2 plus 2, 4, 7 and this one is 8k is equal to 1. So, this will be 10k square plus 8k minus 1 is equal to 0. So, now we need the value of k. For finding the value of k, as we have a formula that this is minus b plus or minus root over b square so this is b square minus 4 into a into c that is 4 into 10 by 2a that is 2 into 10 see here k value is nothing but this is minus 8 plus or minus this is a 64 plus 40 by this is 20 so, the k value here is, this is minus 8 plus or minus root over this value. If I add this value, so this will be 10 to 104. 104 by this value is 20. See, so k value is minus 8 plus or minus. So, this can be written as 4 into 26 by 20. So, if I take this 4 outside, so this will be minus 8 plus or minus 2 root. This is 26 by 20. So, if I cancel for 2 in 2 table, this will be minus 4 plus or minus root 26 by 10. See here, see the value here is, this is minus 4 plus root 26 divided by 10. The value here is nothing but 0 point this is uh, 1 0 double line so we got the value of k as that is k value as that is a 0 point this is 1 0 double line so the next thing what we have to do we have to find out the mean value as well as the variance so for finding the mean see mean means mu that is probability of uh, i is equal to 0 to 6 Next thing what we have to find out the mean value the mean is uh, denoted by mu so mu is equal to this is a sigma i is equal to 0 to 6 this is pi into xi so if I multiply all these so this will be 0 into 0 mu value will be see here mean is equal to this is 0 into 0 this is 1 into 2k this is 2 into this is again 2k 3 into this value is 3k plus 4 into k square plus 5 into this value is 2k square plus 6 into this is a 7k square plus k is equal to 1 see as we are calculating 0 into 0 is 1 so this value is nothing but 2k plus 4k plus 9k this is 4k square plus 10k square plus this value is uh, 42k square plus 6k is equal to 1. So, how many k squares are there? So, this is 42 plus k square. So, which is equal to 46 plus 10. So, this is 56k square plus this value is 21k. If I add all the k's, this will be 21. So, which can be written as... So, this we no need to equate it to 1. So, this is 56k square plus 21k. So, what is our k value here? So, if I take common, 
k that is 56 k plus 21 so as we have k value as see i'll show you the k value the k value is 0 0.1099 that is 0 0.1099 so if I substitute the value of k as this is 0. Point, this is 1099 into this is 56 into this is 0. 0.1099 plus 21. So that will be the mu value. See here the mu value I'll show you that is 56 into 0. Point, this is 1099 plus 21 into again that is 0 0.1099 the value here is nothing but 2.84 see the variance value is 2.842 the value here is 2.9842 so this is our mu value and the next thing we have to find out the variance as you have the variance as we have the variance formulae that is sigma i is equal to 0 to 6 pi into xi square minus this is mu square. So now this time we have to multiply. So this is the table here. This will be 0 square plus 0. See here this value that is the sigma square is equal to this is a 0 into 0 and this value is again 1 square into 2k this is 1 square into 2k plus this value is 2 square into 2k 2 square into 2k plus 3 square into 3k this is 3 square into 3k plus 4 square into k square this is 4 square into k square plus 5 square into 2k square 5 square into 2k square plus this value is a 6 square into this is a 7 k square plus 7 k square plus k. So minus mu square. So the value here is minus mu square as mu value is ready here. So if I multiply this one, so this will be 0 into 0, 0. This is 1 into 2k. 4 into 2k and this is 9 into 3k and this value is 16 into k square plus this value is 5 square 25 into 2k square plus 36 into 7k square plus k minus mu square. What is mu here? This is 2.9842 whole square and r Sigma square is equal to, see here, so if I multiply this one, so this is 2k plus 8k plus 27k plus 16k square plus 50k square and this value is 36 into 7. That is 36 into 7 is 252. 252k square plus this is 36k minus 2 point this is 9842 whole square see now so if i add all these k squares then sigma square is equal to then sigma square is equal to 318 k square plus 73 k minus if i square this so this value will be 8.9054 and see sigma square is equal to if i take k common this is 318 k plus 73 minus this is 8.9054 see sigma square is equal to what is the k value that is 0 0.1099 into this is 318 into 0 0.1099 plus 73 minus this is 8.9054 and see our sigma square value is after calculation the value here is 2.9581 so this is our variance value and uh, this is our uh, this is our mean value that is mu is equal to 2.9842 and this is our k value so this is how we have to f find the value of k mean and variance 
and see have a look at this video for one more time if you don't understand and the calculation part everything you can do by your own using your own calci thank you so much